What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Forcecast episode number two. I'm your boy, Patman, and thank you for tuning in today. What's up, mofos? This is Chad Zilla here with uh, another Forcecast podcast episode, episode two. Uh, it's March 13, 2015, and we got, we got some stuff to talk about. Yeah, uh, episode two of Forcecast and second straight Friday the 13th. That's uh, right. When is, when is the last time that's ever happened? I don't. I don't know, but I hope that's not too unlucky for us. Speaking yeah. of Friday the 14th, let's get right into it, shall we? Or do you want to talk about yeah. some, uh, some channel stats first? Yeah, yeah, we could, uh, let's uh, just, you know, stick to the layout. We usually right. like to so talk about the so channel for, for a little bit. I'll let you go up first then. Okay, first and foremost, your boy Chad Zilla there has our most watched video. He's at like 250 views, which is big for us. Yeah, you guys good. are probably awesome listening to us, like, yeah. You guys are probably like, that's fucking. What, you're you're excited over you 250. Yeah, she ain't got no views. No, really, no, it's good. It's good for us. <laughs> yeah, we only started two weeks ago, yeah, so we, you know we're pushing. We're still pushing. We're we're going. Yeah, we're, going. we're chugging baby. along, baby. So we're really happy with the progress. Yeah. We feel that our uh, videos have been much better quality. Oh, we're knocking uh-huh. them out of the park, I think, lately with our videos. Yeah. If you haven't, if you haven't seen, seen our yeah. videos, go to Triforce Gaming, Gaming Network, Network and check them out. out. Give please us some likes and give us some subscribes. And hey, please, come on, guys. please, join the force. Yeah, we join need, the force. we on. need subs. We need, we need subs. We need comments. We need, we need likes. We, we, we need really need friends. comments. We, I feel, I feel like we need some friends. We need. I feel like you're my only friend right now. That's kind of sorry. It feels like we're just making videos for each other right now. I don't even feel married anymore. I, like my marriage is just—I I don't even feel Let's anything right now. Let's not go there. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, if she listens to this, I'll—I'll I'll fucking be dead. All right. All uh, right so, but, anything yeah, we're. Uh, about... No, sorry, just uh, thank you for the support, guys. Thank you for the views. Spread the word to your friends once again. Um, and we really want to hear from you guys in the comment section, please. I'm trying to be interactive with the community. Um, like I said, we're not a big channel, so I can answer every comment that's posted. That's right. So if you guys want to do something. 30, 30 seconds, seconds or less. 30, 30 seconds, seconds or it's free, free, you know? Yep. There you go. So um, right. without uh, without further ado, let's get right into the juice, juicy right. part of the uh, force cast. Speaking of Friday the 13th, this is awesome. This wasn't, awesome. This wasn't even planned. planned. Friday, Friday the 13th, 13th, and we've got, we've got some, some Friday, Friday the 13th, 13th news, news, actually. actually. Um, yeah, when you hear uh, Friday the 13th, who do you think of, Chad Zilla? I think of... Jason I think of Majora's Mask I think, 3DS. I think of that, but I also think of the creepy masked killer known as Jason that haunted my childhood. All right, anyway, Jason Voorhees, what game do you think he's in? He's actually announced for the new uh, Super Mario Bros. game. He's going to be an unlockable character. Pretty really? Cool. I thought he was coming to Kirby Dreamland. Oh, maybe that was it. I thought it was oh, okay. Mario. I thought it was that new Mario Party 10 game. Uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. He's a new baddie. He is. No, but uh, um, Mortal Mortal Kombat, Mortal, huh? Mortal Kombat X. Uh, Jason Voorhees was just announced from a teaser post on Nether Realm Nether Realm's Twitter account. Um, he's one of four add-on characters in the Combat Pack. It's called, uh, along with Johnny Cage, Melina, and Sonya Blade. It's cool. Yep. yep. Um, Mortal Kombat's actually Kombat's coming, coming up pretty, pretty soon. soon. Um, and launches yep. on April 14th for yep. Xbox, Xbox One, Xbox, Xbox 360, 360, PlayStation 4, PlayStation, PlayStation 3, and, and PC. PC. What do you think? Are you sure it's X? Are you sure it's 360 and PS3? I did. I just did my research. I looked it up, and I'm almost positive. I read. I think I swore it was next gen only. I read it on GameSpot.com um, that it's on 360 and PS3. I know. I, I um. I kind of got, got confused by that. I didn't think they were doing that anymore, but I think yeah, yeah, GameSpot, I didn't think so either. I think GameSpot said that. I mean, I took it right from their website. So, okay, well, if if they're wrong, uh, we'll blame it on them. Yeah, don't look at us. Yeah. We're just some lame don't look at us. So, don't look at us. We'll definitely uh, we'll definitely look into that though yeah, yeah. and see if, I'm, if I'm it almost, is. I'm, uh, you can almost take my word for it. Almost. Almost. Mm. I I always doubt you, so I don't know. That's just my job. But, uh, yeah, it sounds good. Um, so is that combat pack like the season passed or? Beats me. Uh, okay, because I think, I think it's, I know it was, I I know it was 30 bucks. bucks. I think the combat pack, it might, it might be, be the season pass. pass. It, might it might be the first round of the season, season pass, pass, DLC, DLC kind of thing. thing. Yeah. Um, well, there's, 
I'm not. There's what positive. positive. There's like 22 characters confirmed so far right, right. for Mortal Kombat X. So if its season pass is thirty fucking dollars, half the price of the game, we better at least be getting eleven there's, characters. There's probably gonna be a lot of content too, though. Like, there's probably gonna be I would levels hope so. and modes and maps and all that stuff. Or you know, they could have they could have they could have gimped the the actual game, the the retail game, and just making half of the DLC kind of like. Like well, Rare did with well Instinct, developers don't do that, Chad. Oh, oh I know. Oh, I know. They, they, never they never do that, do that right? right? Well, what? Th- that's th- that's crazy talk. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's probably what's going on. Sorry, Ed Boon. I love you and all. I don't but, know. Uh, yeah, again, I don't know. So, so that might be it. That might be what's going on. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's good. That's cool news out of the Mortal Kombat. Yeah, a lot of people were looking forward to the Johnny reveal. Yeah, people, uh, well, well Freddy Krueger was in the last Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat 9, or just Mortal right. Kombat, um, so he was a cool character, so I think Jason's cool, but I really think they could do better. Um, a lot of people were clamoring for Predator, I think that'd be a really cool one, and uh, Spawn. Spawn is rumored to maybe be in it, so that would be really cool. I'm a big fan of Spawn, so I would love to see him in the Mortal Kombat uh, universe. But... Do we want to move on to our next topic? Yeah, we yeah, can we move, can on. move on. Um, okay. Let's see, what do we got? Oh, oh news just out of yesterday, yesterday I, think. I think. I think it was yesterday, yesterday or two days, two days ago. ago. We've, We've got, got a not-so-surprising not so um, um, announcement, announcement by Respawn, by Respawn uh, uh, the, the former, former Infinity Ward guys. guys um, um, Titanfall, Titanfall 2, 2 announced. announced. Yep. Not, not the official the name, of course, of course, but Titanfall 2, right. tentative name. Um and, and the, the other big news coming out of this is that it's multi-platform. Um, right. You're going to see it on the one, one and the PS4, PS4 along, along with the PC. PC. So, right. and you, and you, you played a little bit of Titanfall. Titanfall. What are your, what are your thoughts about that? Uh, I loved it. I thought it was a great game. Uh, Vince Zampella, which is the leader of Respawn, was a modern uh, back in the good old Infinity War days. Uh, right, right. I love you know, that. It's I a big game. His work with uh, uh, Modern Warfare One. Yep, yep, I, and, uh, you know, that whole big Modern Warfare 2 lawsuit they had. Yep, yep. Uh, but I think he did a great job on that game, honestly. That game was kind of started, kind of pioneered maybe this whole EXO movement, you know, and now Halo 5 has the thruster packs, um, right. that whole mobility. And it's kind of like the staple of new shooters nowadays. You, you can't have a slow-paced game anymore, so people clamoring for all that no, old-school no. stuff from right. Halo. It's just not going to work anymore. That's, that's the um, thing with I think, new Call of Duty games, games coming out. Every, every year they're getting, they're getting faster, faster and faster, faster paced, paced, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like, they're just yeah. adding, yeah. Stuff adding stuff to the game, game to make it make so Twitch-based, Twitch-based gameplay that it's, like, like crazy, crazy now. now. Yeah, but Titanfall literally made my eyes bleed, dude. There's just right. so much yeah, going on. It was a cool game. Definitely a cool game. Very cool game. Um, I just wish my 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 here's uh, Pat Man's wish list for Titanfall two. Um, I hope it has a campaign, an actual campaign, instead of an online shoehorned into a multiplayer match campaign. You know, it you know, could it very well, well because, because I know that, that um, they. I think it will. Somebody, somebody from, Re- from Re- I think, I think it's somebody, somebody from Respawn was talking, talking about how hard it is to sell, sell multiplayer, multiplayer only games, games and, it's and it's a really hard sell to consumers being a multiplayer, multiplayer only game. That I think that hurt that, that did hurt Titanfall Titanfall sales, sales a little bit. A little bit. Um, yeah, and I, I don't see why not because there's so much lore and so much room for a story right, and, right. and that could, that could, it's not like that could be vince that could be, zampella doesn't know how to tell a story yeah. modern warfare one and two both had great campaigns that could be, so that could be that such could be a badass, badass campaign, campaign with max and everything just running around doing crazy yeah, shit. yeah 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 so i hope that's one of my checklists the other is i'm a big 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 fan of customization and guns uh there was like two ars in the whole titanfall game right I need more variety on guns. I need more customization as far as reticles, camos, character customization. Um, it was just like one skin. Like you just have one skin and you could choose from – like if you're a sniper, you have a whole other skin for your character. You couldn't choose colors. You couldn't choose pieces of armor. So um, obviously I think you know, with, with it just being a new game, they wanted to test out the water, see if people like it. Now it was a great game. It just died really quickly for me and for a lot of people right, it was, just it was, because it was, it nobody was, was playing. Right, and, right. It was, and it was it was Respawn's first, game, first out game out of that studio, of that studio and it was on a next right. generation right. system. So that's a lot of uncharted territory they were working with. So that could have uh, held Definitely. back a little bit what they could do. I think, I think it was I think awesome. Destiny. I think Titanfall was awesome. Yeah, great game. 
game. I know people loved watching me play it. My my fucking dad was impressed when he saw it. Uh, he was down here in North Carolina when visiting from up there, and uh, he uh, he came down and I was like, "Dad, I'm going to get this new game tonight." And he's like, "Well, what is it?" And I popped it in. He's like, "Dude, this fucking game is I've never seen a game like this, and it really was something different and crazy." Yeah, like when E3, you remember the E3 trailer when we were watching E3 together that year, and that came out, we we're like, "Whoa, what the fuck yeah, is this?" That was, that was it. Was like the final. Stopper. For sure, sure, big thing at the Microsoft press conference. Yeah, yep, yep. So, kind of sucks that, that they lost their exclusivity with it though. But you, who didn't see that coming from a mile away? You know, dude. Yeah, it's been a not like everybody yeah. knew like oh, it was yeah. gonna stay exclusive, and it technically it wasn't because it was on PC too, but it was not on a Sony platform. Yeah, right. So it was, it was kind it was still of PC, PC Microsoft, Microsoft realm. You know, it was all the same, same shit. So, so. right. All right. But yeah, uh, so that that's my Titanfall two wish list and. Uh, yeah, I think it'll yeah, be I awesome. Think Hopefully, I think, think add, add more customizations, more customizations stuff, like yeah. stuff like that. You know, yeah. you know, what, what everyone's what adding, everyone's to, adding their to their shooters, shooters now, now. So that'd be cool. Yep. That'd be cool. I think uh, Destiny kind of had the same problems as Titanfall uh, with its, you know, being the first in the series and treading new waters and all like things like that. I think two Destiny two will blow one out the water, and I think Titanfall two will be what Titanfall one should have been as well. So right, right. stuff to look forward to. Right. Right. Um, um, what else we got else to we talk, talk about, about here? here? Let's talk. Oh, and they. Uh, oh, oh. Go, I'm sorry. On a side note, just in case people didn't know, I'm a big Destiny fan, but uh, Destiny Two was confirmed uh, by Bungie that uh, they are trying to let us carry our characters over. So that would be so, that's something pretty cool just to look forward to. But go ahead on to your next topic. Yeah, we're moving yeah, right we're along. Right along. Um, um, Bloodborne. Bloodborne. In a uh, oh, yes. upcoming, upcoming action, action role playing role video, video game, game by From Software, from, uh, from, yeah. published, published you know, by, no, published by, by Sony, Sony um, um, for, for exclusivity, exclusivity yep. to the PS4. To the PS4. Yep, the it's, only reason, Chad, I would buy PS4 is for this game right here. Right, right. Um, um, and again, and again this, drops, this drops. Oh, this drops oh, in this a couple, drops couple days, days actually. actually. This, um, this um, drops March yep. twenty fourth, twenty fifteen. So look out for that. That's next, coming out really uh, soon. Um, be, not this be, Tuesday, but next Tuesday. Yep. 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 Really? really? What? Two weeks, what, not two weeks from, now. from now? Yep. Um, um, being directed, being directed by, by. Let me get this let me right. Get this right. Hidetaka Miyazaki? Hidetaka Miyazaki, baby. Hidetaka yep, Miyazaki. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Miyazaki, that's my boy. Uh, he's the guy who originally worked on Demon Souls and Dark Souls 1. He was absent from Dark Souls 2. I'm not quite sure the reason. Uh, it was the same developer, but he just didn't lead the design. And you could tell. like Dark Souls 2 was a lot easier than Dark Souls 1, and it was just missing the atmosphere that Dark Souls 1 had. So... Right. This is really exciting because Bloodborne is basically in the Souls series, um, and Demon Souls part. Uh, Demon Souls was a PlayStation exclusive uh, back in the day, and then Dark Souls came to Xbox. So I never got to play Demon Souls, but I heard it's amazing. And Bloodborne, like if you guys haven't seen gameplay, it, it looks like a Dark Souls game, but so, so crazy so good graphics. To get this, to get this right, Bloodborne's, right, Bloodborne's not, not like a. Like a a successor to Dark Souls or a spiritual successor, right? It's its own different game. It's a spiritual successor, yeah. It's it's definitely, it's like, even people say it's part of the Souls series. Like, um, Demon Souls didn't have Dark Souls story in it. Like, it, they were kind of separate, right, but right. there were similarities right. between the worlds. Like, they're, like lore-wise, there was actually some stuff that you could maybe paint connections to. So maybe Bloodborne will have some cool stuff like that. But combat-wise and how difficult it looks uh it looks just like a dark souls game you would think it's a ripoff of dark souls right, if right. uh you know if you didn't know any better that was made by the same people right, and that's right. you know that's right around that's the corner, right so, that's, so that's i guess you can call that one of the first big games of the year uh, uh yeah or an uh, definitely a huge game for playstation you know finally they finally, get it yeah, finally, finally let's talk about let's that talk for a second like playstation, PlayStation you know when they're no, i remember i was working at best buy when they when they were launching their ps4 and it was all about how we have the best games we have all this stuff you know and you know i i jumped right on the hype train and bought one and ever since that i have not seen a game that that was worth buying buying you know, they were all no, multi platform games. games. Nothing, Nothing was, exclusive, was exclusive, you know? You know? So, yeah. So. yeah um, and I, and I, this is a really I still this is a good I, I mean, this, I mean, don't get me wrong, the system's system still system sound like crazy, like crazy, right? All right. It's, yeah. just, it's just, you know, it doesn't you know, have I don't get exclusives with it yet. With it yet. And, and this and is, is going to help it out. I just don't get, 
Well, two things. I don't get how the hell this is. I mean, I know it's cheap um, and it's, you know, more powerful, blah, blah, blah. Uh, there's parity between the consoles. I mean, I, the, the, the PS3 was stronger than the 360, but when you have developers, you know, porting them for, to both ends, and that one version is going to not look that much better than the other. So that whole pop, more powerful thing, you might see it in the exclusives, but um, judging from Xbox One's exclusives as well, as well, those have looked pretty damn nice too, and Halo 5 is going to look beautiful, Sunset Overdrive was cool, Forza was a beautiful game. So um, that whole, I, I just don't get how... It is selling so well with such a lack of exclusive games because that's why I buy my consoles. That's why I don't buy PlayStation. Like right, it's, none right, of dude, the exclusives. It's, honestly, it's all marketing it's right, right now. Right I think the market knocked it out of the ballpark, out of the ballpark, ballpark with this system. You yeah. know, yeah. greatness awaits. Yeah, all that stuff. Uh, I mean, it was awesome. What did it say? But great, um, great, like something, like all the something, best all the games best are here. Or something, something, the best the gamers best play here. Yeah. Stuff like that. like that. You know. Well, Xbox has something similar now. Like the best games live on Xbox yeah, right. One or something. the same effect, right? Right. Yeah. 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 Well, Microsoft's definitely learned a few things from Sony as far as marketing. Uh, they're definitely pushing. They lowered the price. The Xbox One actually. Uh, that's another fact to just throw out there. Eighty-four percent sale increase in February. PlayStation still led sales in February as far as consoles go, but. Uh, Xbox went up. Xbox One went up, went up forty uh, eighty four percent in sales. I believe right. it was. Yeah, yeah. Xbox oh, yeah. is doing oh, a lot better. A lot better. Uh, definitely. definitely. Yeah, definitely. With that price drop, I mean, uh, it was a little overpriced at five hundred, especially was, if yeah. it was in had to connect to an inferior console. Yeah, um, but when Halo came out, I felt I needed it. Uh, Sunset Overdrive was a great game. That that's actually really under the radar exclusive that I thought was really good, and that was made by Insomniac, a old uh, PlayStation. Uh, you know, they used to, I think, Ratchet and Clank in the Resistance games, right? Was Insomniac? Yeah, they were yeah, Ratchet they and were Clank. Ratchet uh, those were awesome games. Awesome I loved games. Ratchet and Clank. Ratchet yeah. Um, um, yeah. You know, I remember playing them with my cousin way back in the day and collecting all the, the, the bolts and stuff. And there's there's, there's, so, there's so many so Ratchet. So the first few Ratchet, Ratchet games were good, but the, the, the you know, recent ones that haven't been that great. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of those kind of get like, you know, just like Crash lost his... Lost its kind of mojo too. Yeah, uh, all yeah, those. I know. Yeah, nothing I know. Nothing really Classic. special happened special with Crash, crash lately, lately either. So, so. yeah. All right. All but right. speaking of, uh, well, yeah, Bloodborne, March twenty fourth. Uh, I can't wait to see it. I hope it's as good as Dark Souls. I hope uh, you PlayStation guys enjoy it. Uh, maybe down the road, I'll probably get a PlayStation four just to play that oh, yeah, game. It'll so, be, yeah, it'll uh, be a good game. Be a good game. Yeah, definitely. And now, uh, speaking of PlayStation exclusives, big news. Uh, that Sony's going to have a big gap in its uh, holiday lineup this year, isn't it? It is, yeah. It is, yeah. Huge, gap. Huge gap. You won't even be able to won't find, even it. find yeah. it. An uncharted, uncharted gap, gap, if you can call it. Call nope. It. Ooh, oh, I see what you did there. I see what you did there. Nice. It's, it's not even so, charted. Yeah. They can't find the game. The game is lost, so it's going to be pushed. It's going to be pushed. They can't find it. They deleted it off their computers. Uncharted forever. Get it? Uncharted forever. Uncharted forever lost. That's what it's called. Forever lost. We yes. can we can four so, games uh, and they still games can't chart can't anything. Chart I don't I don't I get don't, it. I don't get it. I don't get that. How are you so lost? How are you lost? For you four lost? fucking games. I don't I don't understand. I don't get that, Sony. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, yeah. But yeah, but yeah that's, dude. That's pretty much. That's pretty much I, mean, I mean, I don't even think that was part of Pax East, East, but that was the only thing that really came out of Pax East. Was Uncharted Four being delayed till spring of 2016. So that's only that's a pushback to a year now. Yep, yep. Uh, so, what the fuck is Sony going to do this holiday season unless they have something up their sleeves, dude? They might, maybe they're doing some sort of collection or something. They're going to do. What was that? What was that game that launched with the PS4 called? Fuck. Knack. Knack 2. Return of Knack. Oh, God. Or Knack. Terrible. Knack. Uncharted Edition. Knack. Oh, put some Uncharted skins in it. It will sell like fucking gold. Hot cakes. Hot cakes, baby. Hot cakes, baby. Yeah, All right. maybe they have a God of Well, no, I doubt, like, without announcing anything, that they have, like, a oh, God of War sick. or anything. You know what, you know what they're going to pull? They're going to pull one of those collections or HD remakes or something that they always do and get them something. Yeah, I mean, that, they have yeah, to. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's what's going to happen. But no, we're looking because forward to, like, to E3. They're going to have, they're gonna have they're something, gonna have something for, for holiday E3, no doubt. That's coming up soon. They don't have a choice. They don't have a choice. Either go out of business or come out with a big game. It's your choice. Yeah, because they there's no more excuse for games not being on PS4. Right, right now right. um and especially after that first year is out through the console cycle look at microsoft's lineup this year it is That's packed what I'm saying. Dude, like, so it's, it's kind of it's kind of a reversal, reversal you know you know yeah yep yep exactly yep so so that's that that's um that. let's yep. see let's see 
We got that out of the way. Other than freaky Other than people freaky in costumes or packs. Let's talk uh, Let's talk a little talk bit of Call of Duty. Can't have a podcast have without Call of Duty, right? Can't have a fucking anything on our channel without so, Call of Duty. Yeah. Come on. Bro. So, um, so um, Activision, Activision um, um, was seeing dollar signs dollar in their eyes again, and they 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 they, 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 they dreamt they, up they something dreamt in their sleep real quick. They thought, they thought, oh really? Why don't, yeah. why don't we just why start, we just start selling, selling items to people? Items to people. I, I, oh my god! A la, a la, microtransactions in Call a la, of Duty? A la, a la, Team Fortress Team Two Fortress or something with heads? Allah, are we Muslim? La 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 la. Yeah, so yeah, Call of so Duty Call Advanced, Duty, Warfare, Advanced Warfare, Warfare got introduced. Got introduced advanced, advanced supply drops. Supply drops. Um, um, adva- here's the here's the here's straight out of the horse's mouth. Advanced supply Advanced drops will contain drops will three random loot, random loot items, loot items including, at including at least one weapon one variant, variant, variant and at least one, and at least one item of professional, professional rarity or greater. Or greater. Items, items from advanced, advanced supply, supply drops can be used to upgrade loadouts, loadouts and personalize, and personalize an, operator, an operator, or they can be or redeemed, can for, be XP. redeemed for XP. Um, so single um, so advanced, advanced supply, supply drops containing drops three items can be purchased items individually for $1.99 US. Right. Multiple ones Multiple can be ones purchased can be for, purchased you know, you can do three you know, advanced three supply drops for five ninety nine, nine total items, total items. Um, five, um, advanced five advanced supply drops, drops for nine ninety nine. Um, that's eighteen, um, that's 18 items, items total, and then total, ten, and 10 supply, supply drops plus three plus bonus three advanced bonus supply drops supply for nineteen ninety nine, thirty nine total items. So get ready to shell out some cash, boys and girls. G Martin. Yeah. Yeah. No, but what do you think yeah, about that? You play Call of Duty a lot, Duty so. a lot, so don't 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 disgrace my character by saying something like that. Well, what do you what do you, what think, you about think about the whole supply whole drop? Supply drop, uh, advanced uh, supply drop. I paying think for items, paying pretty for much. items, pretty much. I think I bought two already. Did you? Did you? That's what I think. Yeah, I did. And I got shit. I got shit from them, so I will never buy. I had five dollars on my Microsoft account. I'm like, what am I gonna ever use those five dollars on besides microtransactions? So I said, fuck it, I'll buy it. Right, um, right, right. And I have to look it up because I somehow got advanced supply drops in game now. Because there's supply drops, which is what you earn in the game regular, and then the advanced ones are the ones you buy. But when, when I prestiged and and one other time, I got an advanced supply drop without paying any money, and I actually got like the best gun in the game the other day. Um, playing but as far as opinions on this goes um, I have very strong opinions on paying to win but it's at the same time it is completely it? random I, I, what if what if the what next if, Call of yeah. Duty comes out with a $20 price $20 tag and it's uh, a pay to win game would you be surprised yeah you know surprised? like no, no I, I, wouldn't, I, wouldn't I wouldn't be because they make either. more money they, that way they make a lot more money doing that because they suck you yeah, in with a, yeah, a yeah. small price tag and then bam, 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 buy this gun, buy this yeah, gun. Yeah, I think what, well, Black Ops 2 started the microtransactions, yeah, right? Yeah, I think they did. Yeah, I think they did. Yep, and uh, it's been getting more prominent in each Call of Duty since. And now with all these customization op- options and different variants of guns, they went, I mean, the, there's no reason they shouldn't have did it. And I get it from a business standpoint, but... At the same time, it's you know like T. Martin spent like hundreds and hundreds of dollars buying two. He bought as many as you possibly can. You can't buy anymore. You bought two hundred thirty. So I think there is a limit uh, for now. Oh. And he didn't get that really that many good guns. He got maybe right. two or three really good guns, and the rest were shitty. So you have to have luck still. But at the same time, um, like twenty dollars. Seriously, you want twenty extra dollars for? Like that's just crazy, man. Like we already spent fifty on the right. DLC pass, sixty on the game, and now all these microtransactions. This that and they come out every year. It's not like it's a game that lasts a while, right. you know. There's an update, right. every, year update for it. every year for it. Yeah, I'm, I don't. I'm, I'm, to play I'm, devil's, I'm, advocate, play devil's here, advocate here, though. Here, though. Um, um, nobody's telling you to go out and buy these supply drops. You don't need. You don't right. need these to 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 be successful as a game. But it definitely does help. Definitely does help. Definitely, um, and but that's the thing with anything. Nobody's right. going to you to tell right. out and no, buy yeah, the right. game, Definitely. but Definitely. there's it's the marketing, it's the feel of getting that good gun you've always right. wanted. It's and, just it's like gambling, you know. It's right. addicting. The competitive right. community the competitive is huge for it, and they're going to go crazy for it because you know you've, you've got to have right. the, best of the, have best. the best of the best. Which I totally right. get that. I mean, I'm a I'm a competitive I'm a, gamer. I love it. You know, the the rush is it's crazy. So it's definitely fun to do. So. 
Speaking of competitive gaming, when when are we starting our uh, competitive oh, gaming Oh, we need team? to get some, oh, we we need to yeah, start we're going to get some people yeah, together and we're going to go together, take over MLG take over and MLG take all their money. Um, yeah, we're taking all the money, baby. Uh, TFGamingProductions.com if you want to join Triforce Gaming. We're going to be touring around the United States next year. I called it. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. Right. Right. Okay. Um, and if we do get bigger, hey, we might be looking for people to help out with the channel. For real. So for real. Take a look out. For real. I could be your CEO could be your one day. CEO one day. As long as I'm co CEO, right? Oh, I man. get credit oh, yeah. too, right? Oh, yeah. You'll be you'll be oh, on the plaque. You'll be on the plaque too. Okay, in good. The, in the corner. In the, in the corner. We'll be in for. <laughs> It'll be my big <laughs> Fortune five hundred face on the plaque, and then, the then your name. Uh, name. Uh, honorable, then just like honorable mention. Honorable mention. Pat. Just just a little Batman symbol, and it says Pat Man. Doesn't even show my All picture. Right, so let's move. All right, so let's, let's move right move along right to. This is just a little speculation. Um, talk a little bit about uh. COD 2015. Uh, yeah, it should be announced, uh, yeah, should be announced any, any any month now. Any month. Uh, I'm assuming June. It's going to be maybe sooner. They've been they've been announcing them sooner. No, they actually. usually do May first week yeah. of May is usually when they announce all the Call of Duty. So yeah, hey, it's going to yeah. come next year. They're going to announce it a week after the new one comes out. So be ready for that. It's coming. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely coming. So, uh, yeah, um. And it's right around my birthday too, like a week after my birthday. Usually announce it, so that's yeah, cool. it's like a birthday yeah, present. Uh, Activision, give me more of your money. Yeah, give me your birthday, little money, birthday Pat. present. Money, Pat. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's talk a little bit about Treyarch's card. All right, so, all right, and so first of all, Treyarch is now my favorite Call of Duty developer. Call of Duty developer. Could you believe that? Yeah, they've been my. I I I I shunned Treyarch for the World at War days. World at War days. Um, I love yeah. And COD three. Don't forget. Oh, I love COD 3, though, using that little, using the, little, rocket the rocket launcher to hit people in the head with, and just with. everything was so fun about that game. Was, I loved it. I loved it. Uh, so many glitches. Uh, so many you, could, you could glitch your way up walls, and it was, it was nuts. It was nuts. All right. All right. Yeah. But a lot of people love World at War. I didn't get a didn't chance. Play I played, like, one match of it, like, a few years after it came out. But, like, dude, like, people preach that World at War is one of the best yeah, yeah, CODs, so I would love to try it. But, um... That's why I want a World at War 2, even though Black Ops 1 and 2 are my one of my two favorite. I love Modern Warfare 1 and 2, but Black Ops 1 is probably my top COD with Modern Warfare 2, and then Black Ops 2 after that, then Modern Warfare right. 1. Right. So I would love, this is coming from a Black Ops fan, I would love a World at War 2 uh, and go back to the old days. I think we need something. You don't need the exosuits to be different. I want the exosuits back, honestly. Yeah. They may do it, they could. You never know. but I don't want it. Know. They could go even far. I'm just kind of you could, sick you of this future thing. I was actually robot. thought that who knows? Robot. You might just be you might that, just be a robot. Dude, that's literally what I just said with my friend last night. We we're hey. playing zombies. I'm like, dude, if it's Black Ops three, we're not even gonna be people anymore. It's gonna we're gonna be fucking gonna mechs be robot. and robots. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be so Mech Warrior, Mech it, Warrior four, four or whatever they're on. Titanfall sixteen. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but I don't know. Yeah, I, I've heard I've heard yeah, that there have been rumors of Black Ops three and World at War two. I don't know if those are senseless rumors and just a, a child in his basement is basement saying that saying and putting that on the yeah, internet. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. But, but um, but um, it could be a totally new series. It, like Call of Duty has not. Duty I mean, has after not, Modern Warfare, they pretty much they pretty much done nothing. Done nothing. Um, um. Nothing, expected. Yeah, you could say nothing expected. Yeah, say nothing nothing expected. chronological nothing anymore, chronological I guess you could say. Anymore, I guess you could say. So Yeah, yeah, it's been a bunch of spin all you know, like ghosts and stuff, like Ghost Two is probably I'm the right. only fucking guy yeah, who predicted Black Ops ghosts. Two was gonna come out after Black Ops one. Happen. Like I you said, swore I, said, I, said, I, said, I was I wrong. No way they're gonna do a Black no Ops two. Black Ops two. Yeah. But hey, I was yeah. wrong. So, but hey, I was so, wrong. So Um David Vandahar, which is uh lead multi uh I think he's a lead multiplayer designer at, at Treyarch. Uh he's like the face of Treyarch when you when you think of Treyarch, it's David. It's the bald guy, oh, David yeah, Von. Now, now, yeah, everybody yeah, makes now, fun. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, he tweeted out an image. I want to say a couple months back, and just showed a picture of a. It said "Bald Ops 3. and it was like his face, but it was an actual soldier. It looked like an actual game cover. So who knows? Maybe he just cropped his face onto the actual Black Ops mm-hmm. Three uh, right. game cover. Right. Uh, but that's that could just be a really funny joke or just or, yeah, it or could just, be an inside yeah, joke for you know for his employees yeah. or, or or it could be or it could be so stupid that nobody's really gonna think really that, gonna this, think exists, really you know? think that this is it you know but that i think that's right. what sparked that, the rumors of black ops 3 black ops 3 yeah but yeah i know i'd like to see another future setting obviously if it's gonna be black ops 3 it's not gonna go back in time to world war 2 or vietnam or any of that shit 
So I would I would like to so see no because I think uh, progress more. I think the whole World at War Two uh, thing started with um, the uh, on Pearl Harbor Day on December seventh. I think that is uh, Treyarch tweeted something out about Pearl Harbor and it had something to do with like people are like oh my god that World at War Two confirmed fucking Illuminati confirmed okay, you know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Insert insert wow guy there right there for wow. me, Chad. Wow. wow. <laughs> uh, so yeah. <laughs> uh, so yeah. So wish list for Call of Duty 2015. Do you want me to go ahead, or no, you, you want to go your, ahead and tell me what you want? List. I'm, done I'm done with Call of Duty. Duty. Are you, you're I'm not done, done yet. What if it's Black Ops? I haven't Ghost, and that's crazy for me. That's crazy for me. That was one Call of Duty ago, bro. I know. That's I really know. good for me. That's really good for me. <laughs> well, you should have skipped out on Ghost and Bud. It's know, a better I game. I Advanced should've. Warfare is. But uh, anyways, uh, if it's Black Ops 3, wish list yeah. is... Yeah. Uh, Treyarch really started the customization thing in, in Call of Duty with the... Uh, Go- or, uh, Black Ops 1 had like the your little character and you could fucking you know, customize them a little bit here and there. Um, and the camels were cool and stuff, but Advanced Warfare really stepped it up. So I really want to see Treyarch go all out. Uh, maybe, cr- dude, you know, it'd be sick if you could create a character like an RPG, like make a character in his face and everything, and that be your soldier in Call of Duty. Uh, I really want customization to go all out. The whole emblem editor thing was awesome with Black Ops One, um, and I really like the verticality on the maps and stuff uh, that Advanced Warfare does. So. Um, maybe if it's if it's like fucking dude, even if it's like a World at War two, they could do like a spin on it, like steampunk, and have like steampunk punk uh, exo suits and shit if they wanted to incorporate exos. But um, I do like the verticality. So if it is Black Ops three, maybe exo suits come back, but just improve on it. And my biggest, my two biggest things, and I've been preaching this about God on my Preach. wish list: Preach. dedicated servers. Preach it, baby. Dedicated fucking servers, please. You guys have billions of dollars from Call of Duty. Stop being cheap, Activision. Give us our dedicated servers because Pat Man told you to. Second, a new engine. Now, I really... This, I think, is going to happen. You're not going to see that. See that. Gonna I think it is. Updated engine from the engine they've been using since 1989. But it is a... This is the first next gen only call of duty it's been confirmed so that's why i'm thinking that piece of information alone kind of screams Here's new engine fun to me. Fact. Here's another fun so. fact um the um, legend of zelda the 1 of zelda actually, actually ran on actually the same engine as call of duty call advanced duty. warfare does today advanced warfare does today they didn't know that they didn't know that <laughs> the fuck out of here <laughs> all right enough call of duty all talk right, then enough call of duty talk then so, but that, that that's a serious fact that's a that is a fact. Yeah, you could look that up on Wikipedia. Up on Wikipedia. Because it's on Wikipedia. All right, you chid. Well, right. let's talk about some updates. Well, about some two updates. big systems two got two big, big updates. Two big updates. Like literally, Xbox One is huge. It's a huge let's, system. Literally, let's, it's a brick. Literally, it's a brick. It's just it's a, a black, just brick. black brick. Black brick. It's a brick, and then the power brick is like a real life size brick. Yeah. yeah. It's just a lot of yeah. building blocks. Building blocks. So what did this yes, brick get? It, it got the ability to screenshot. Ability to screenshot. Uh, uh, tell, 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 tell them about tell, your what your friend, did, your, with what your friend, your friend did with the screenshots the other day. That was funny. <laughs> so on Xbox One, it has a little activity feed, kind of like a Twitter or something, uh, and it shows you what your friends have been doing recently. And as soon as the screenshot feature went live, uh, one of my friends was on GTA, and you could. With the screenshot, you can make it a background, a custom background on your on your dashboard. So my friend literally took nine pictures of a prostitute, not a prostitute, but a stripper in Grand Theft Auto Five, of her sliding down the pole and her butt ass naked, like six different angles, and took eight different pictures. <laughs> That's totally what I would do. Just like I would do, pervert, I would, I would do, totally do that. Totally do that. Fucking jack it off the cartoon to these. So. Uh, for all that, you could like if ways kids, to get if you, real if you porn. Do that, just, just, just block it. Just, just we don't. We don't want to see that. We, don't, we, don't, we look at real porn. We don't want to see this. This GTA yeah, please, porn. Fucking, yeah, if you're listening to this Xbox Live friend, update your privacy settings. I don't want to see that. Come shit. Come on, this is for yeah. kids. This is for kids. <laughs> 
I can just I can just see that now. All those pictures of that stuff, and then these kids going on Xbox. Imagine that on Wii U, bro. Imagine this. Imagine a, a Nintendo system with that kind of stuff on it. Oh, that'd be crazy. Oh, that'd Nintendo's be crazy. fucking right, heads so, would explode. Right, like, yeah. So, fuck. Um, yeah. More um, updates. More um, updates. Um, all right, so what else came with this? Uh, tile, 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 improved tile transparency. Improved tile transparency. Improved tile transparency. I'm assuming that just means you can see through your tiles easier to your background. Yeah, the uh, on the dashboard now, um, before it was uh, – the, the last update they did last month introduced tile transparency so you could see your backgrounds better because before you couldn't even see your backgrounds because all the fucking tiles right. on the dashboard. Yeah. Right. But now you could actually adjust if you want it fully transparent, semi-transparent, solid or, you know – um, so that's cool. Just a little added right, feature. Right, and it's the same way with my right, Windows 8. I'd like them to add that to I'd Windows like 8 too, so I don't have to look at those big ass bricks. Microsoft, Microsoft bricks. just likes Microsoft bricks. Just likes bricks. They love bricks. bricks. They just square bricks. shit. Just they love Gucci yeah. name. Bricks. Yeah. bricks. 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 <laughs> Um, uh, um so, so party, party chat. chat there's party, party chat enhancements party that means chat. you can now party chat now your party chat dick pics to 16, 16 little children 16 i guess i don't know children, what is it what does it add what is it what does yeah. it add yeah um um party chat is basically they just added a couple icons when you go into a party now it, it kind of gives you updates on what's going on in the party if people are okay. connecting to the chat because okay. you know how fucked up xbox one chat is everybody so it's just showing if people are connecting having trouble connecting if they're using a connect or a regular headset it has like these little teeny emblems to let you know what's going yeah, on which is so. cool yeah, um stuff. and then it also um, added yeah. a suggested added friends, friends feature friends where you can find friends right. with similar friends interest with similar um interest. To you, if you take pictures yeah, of strippers in GTA, strippers it'll in friend GTA, you with other creepy you little. You'll find a fucking whole right. cult yeah, of find other people. Yeah. people that take pictures of video game boobies. Maybe I could find other. Yeah, yeah you, you never know. Yeah, you, you never I, know. I, I, people get married I, I, through that service all the time. That service all the time. Yep. Cue the. Wow. 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 Um, and then there's it's um another another. Feature uh, thing here it says you can report thing, spam. Can report um, spam. Um, yeah, yeah. This for some reason it's been yeah, a problem on Xbox yeah, lately, yeah. Uh, getting spam messages. So yeah. that's good. Good job, Microsoft. I could really, really uh, commend Microsoft. Uh, all the hate they've been getting, but uh, with what they've been doing these monthly updates, there have been some pretty significant stuff. They're really listening to f uh, fan feedback. So thank you, Phil Spencer. Uh, you are the man, and uh, it's awesome. And uh, hopefully would be nice if they can do USB microphone support soon so I could use my Snowball uh, on the Xbox yeah, One nice. Upload Studio. It would yeah, be shout awesome. Out snowball for these awesome yeah. mics. For these awesome mics. Yeah. And beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Beautiful yeah, we love them. We love them. Yes. Well, mine's black. Mine's I couldn't afford the aluminum. aluminum bro. Mine's aluminum, bro. It's um, you know, protect okay. you from the aliens and, if you okay. put it on your head. Out of the more... Out of the more... Out of the other side of the world. Of the other side of the world. Um, PlayStation. Um, Japan. Japan. The, Japan. Pres, the PlayStation... The PlayStation, the PlayStation, the PlayStation, the PlayStation 4. PlayStation got 4. system got update 2.5. Yuki Mora. Yuki Mora. That, uh, that sounded oh, French no, for that was, a second that was there. Oh, no, that, was, that, was that was supposed to be, be Korean or wherever they're from. Japan. Japan. Oh, yeah, fucking Asian. We'll just say Asian. PS4, it's nice and broad. 2. 5, PS4, Yukimura, 2. 5, download Yukimura. it now. Download it now. Um, um, it added 60 frames added per second 60 streaming. Per second streaming. Um, um, for Twitch and for... for Twitch and yeah, for, round of applause. Yeah, round of applause. Um, added 60 frames um, streaming 60 for frames Twitch. Streaming and you can you can, and uh, upload, you can, you can stream, upload the Ustream um, and um, stuff like that. Stuff like that. It also added cool. a friend finder, yeah. a friend um, finder. but it's for Facebook friend um, finder. Facebook I'm assuming friend it's finder. Um, I'm assuming finding it's, other Facebook um, friends that play the PlayStation 4. Who uses yeah. Facebook anymore? Yeah. It's all about Twitter. Follow about us at Three Force Gaming. All about that Twitter, Twitter baby. Um, yep. Um, Three Force Gaming. Um, you can. I thought this was. Numbers. I thought this was supposed to be a feature from launch, but I. I sold my PS4, so I have no idea anymore. Um, system suspend and resume. You're supposed to be able to suspend the your your game state and then resume it by shutting off the system and turning it back on. I believe. I think that's how it works. Um, let me look right here. Hang on. So you can't resume your no, game like if you leave an application no, or anything can, on PS4. You're supposed to be able to shut the system off and then back on. 
and it will look, resume the game. Let me look here. Let me look here. That would sound like it'd be a cool feature, like especially in a standby state. If you have your it's PS4 set to a standby like state, because that, 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 that was supposed to be at launch, but it, 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 it didn't launch, happen. It, it didn't happen. <laughs> You know how these fucking oh, yeah. guys are. Oh, the yeah. Xbox promises oh, a whole yeah. bunch of things that are still oh, on its yeah. way. Oh, yeah. You know, like the power of the cloud. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, um. It also added, it also the, added absolute the absolute worst feature. Absolute I, would worst feature. Use I would never be, use. I would never because I would be scared <laughs> for my <laughs> life <laughs> that this. Because I cried from fat South Park. Nerd that, from remember South that fat nerd episode. Fat nerd episode. Um. How do you kill one You're which right. has no life? I feel like, okay, they added remote, <laughs> okay, they remote play, 60 frames per second remote play, which means you can, means you can, and your drunken you buddies can go and control your little brother's your little PlayStation, PlayStation 4 PlayStation and delete all of his data that, that, that he's worked so hard on, he skipped so school on, for, and you can absolutely delete it off the face of the world. And he will cry. Cry to your mom, and then you're fucking grounded. He will cry and put it on YouTube. So don't do it. All right. Um, yes. You want to. You want to. You want to tell, tell that story that story that came out. <laughs> came out. I swear, hours after this. So, hours dude, after this even game. Bungie posted this on their weekly update. Like Bungie even knew about it. Yeah. And they thought it was funny. Yeah. So, some jerk decides to. Uh, uh, this little kid uh, was playing Destiny, and some jerk uh, decides to send him the invite. Like, hey, you know, remote play, whatever. The kid's like, yeah, sure. Uh, he's like. <laughs> The kid's like, oh, this is like a, uh infinite whatever hack or something this guy's going to show me. So the guy must have right. promised him something, which right. is kind of funny that he kind of got Never what's coming to him anyways. Never trust anybody on the internet. Ever. 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 Uh, trolls everywhere. Um, so <laughs> this guy takes over. The kid walks away. You know, the guy pretends he's playing, and then the kid walks away. And when he realizes the kid walks away uh, from the system... Which you should never do, anyways, with the remote play feature. Another lesson learned. Uh, he he goes back to main menu, and this kid had like level thirty one, level twenty nine, and like a level twenty two character. And if you don't know, level thirty two is the cap in Destiny, so he was pretty close. Uh, he deletes all three of the characters. Kid comes back, uh, and when he realizes what the guy has done, because he he like boots him. He boots him off the game because uh, he saved, like, one character, like, the lowest rank character. He boots him off the game and relaunches. You have to relaunch, like, the software or something. So he relaunches the software. And then when he realizes back at the main menu that his two highest ranked characters are gone, he just breaks down. He's like, oh, no. <laughs> and he just starts crying. Oh, it's hilarious, so sad, honestly. But, it's so funny. but I have no heart when it comes oh, to that's little so kids funny. like that, oh, except that's for my. So own. Funny. I hate. Can you just imagine so, being in his uh, spot though? Like, oh spot, look, this nice though, little guy, oh, this look, nice old man. Guy, nah, this, I don't know why he's an old man. This, this nice man on online is gonna help me help me get infinite whatever he promised, and and then. That, he realizes that the well, first of all, I'm not that the, and I know real, everything. He video realizes games, so that the world is a cruel, cruel place, and this man cruel just cruel goes and deletes all of his work. Terrible. All of his <laughs> oh, that's that's great. And the the, the world great. only got worse on that's the internet. Great. So that's I mean, the internet's just a terrible place to trust people. I, Don't I, do it. Uh, but really I think funny. that was funny. That was really I think that's a really cool feature, though. Like you know, the guy suck at Call of Duty and he pet and to take over for you, boost your KD for you. You know, yeah. Um, that was actually my idea for Twitch. I wanted that. I was like, dude, it'd be sweet if Twitch would let you right. control somebody's game right. uh, while you're watching them. No, I think that, that would be else. awesome. Again, that was supposed to be at launch, but that it never happened. But it never happened. But now right. it's coming out a year and a half later. Two years. Almost Just two like years the games. Later, the games, years. games, right. games. Right. So. Right. So. Right. Yeah. So PS4 uh, update, firmware update. Go download it now. Xbox One Live. Go download it now. Unless you have your system set to uh standby or else it would already right. be downloaded right. wow 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 all right uh all right. i think what's that next buddy up our news for the week actually um there wasn't really there wasn't really much that happened this week there wasn't really much that happened this week um no not much um, uh but i would like to talk about something it. go for it battlefield oh, right, hardline yeah, you can oh, right, go for yeah, it you can go go for it go 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 um uh, battlefield hardline i played it yeah, yeah. A round of wow. applause for me, please. Wow. Wow. 
So I played uh, Battlefield Hardline because I have EA Access, which is a yearly subscription thing that gets you discounts on EA games uh, and free trials of games before they come out. Usually it was a six-hour trial, um, but for Battlefield Hardline, I decided to do 10 hours, and I got to play one mission and campaign, and the rest I can play in multiplayer. Uh, I haven't used all 10 of those hours up yet because, honestly, I can't stand this game. But uh, Battlefield's never been that much of my cup of tea, but I did enjoy 4, 3, and Bad Company 2. Like, I enjoyed them enough to buy them. I'm not going to buy Battlefield Hardline from what I've played. Now I'm going to play a little bit more. Um, I thought the first level of the campaign, it started out really cool, but there was a bunch of filler that made it really boring, and then the last segment is kind of cool uh, in the first mission. So it could totally be a kick-ass campaign, but like the first mission just didn't leave me with, holy shit, I want to play this game. Uh, and then on multiplayer, man, uh, I've said this since day one because I played the beta. I feel that the cops and robbers thing could be an add-on to Battlefield 4. Like, there doesn't need to be a whole new game. But you could almost say that with, like, a Call of Duty. It's just a reskin. So, I get it. Uh, I was just hoping Visceral, since it was a new studio, that they'd bring something new and refreshing to the series. Um, which, as far as customization and stuff goes, they did. Uh, it's it's pretty cool. It's got some sweet customization options, which, uh, if you guys want to see a little preview of that, go check out my video, please. Uh, but... Yeah, uh, just too many people, like, just so much camping in Battlefield, like, people chilling on rooftops, and you can spawn on your teammates so that you could all camp together, and I can't get out of my spawn. It's just frustrating, and you could just say, hey, kid, get better, you but... Gotta, you, gotta, um, you gotta squat up with Chad, and, up and with I'll, Chad. I'll show you the ways of Battlefield. Ways it's, it's it's oh, well, if I had some, yeah, if I had some peeps with me, I'm sure I'd be run oh, yeah, shit, dude, but, you know, you need to get an Xbox still. Uh... I was actually oh, really good oh, at Battlefield. Right, speaking before. of that, um, we just we just added a, a new a new donation thing. Um, a new um, you can if you like our videos, you can donate to us completely. Um, and it will go towards um right now it's probably gonna go towards more new equipment for our, uh, making videos better. We're probably gonna we're probably gonna get another Xbox One so we can do stuff together like that and um pretty much just stuff that we need. We got our webcams today. This is all coming out of pocket for us, so it's a lot of money. Um. Um, but we, yeah. we'd like but you guys like to help us so you can help support our our, our our video our uploads. Video uploads. So, so do you want to help us yeah. out? Go, 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 for it. go for it. Help us do what we oh, love because yeah. honestly, oh, yeah. we we do love this and this is like our dream. Uh, and hopefully, people realize that because uh, I my philosophy on life is always do what you love uh, to do in games and you know hanging out with my best friend is like. What could be better, playing games and, you know, chilling with Chadzilla. He's a pretty cool guy. So um, that's, like, my dream, guys. Uh, I don't know Chad feels the same way. He wants to do what he loves. And if I get the opportunity to do that, why wouldn't you do it? Uh, and now is the best time probably to get into YouTube. A lot of people are having success. Uh, but right now we tried to get the best stuff we possibly could. We really got – I mean, we got the best capture card in the market, with the Elgato HD60. So thank you, Elgato. Right. Right. Uh, we love it. We got some of the best microphones to Blue Snowball. Uh, there's maybe a couple ones that might be better, but, hey, it's pretty good baseline stuff. We just went out and bought HD webcams. You know, we're trying to give you guys really good content. Uh, hopefully you like it. Play hopefully you like content, us. Content. Yes. Uh, I mean, we're we're working on uh, – we just put up three videos yesterday, four videos yesterday if you count, you know, the little Wii U one. You know, like we, we're trying to do a lot of yep. content for yep. you guys. Yep. And – uh, hopefully so you like tuned. it. If we you don't you, know, we let us know. We, we need, need you to like. We need you to follow like. us. We need you to love yeah. us. Yeah. Love, yeah. love, love us, please. Yeah. I need so love. That's, um, so that's, um, that's our podcast that's for the week, podcast, I think, right there. In a nutshell. Um, future um, stuff yep. we're going to do. Future look forward to um, hopefully a dual Let's Play. I know we've been saying it forever, but we're finally going to try to lift that off the ground. And also for my singular Let's Play, I'm really, i really trying to do Hyrule Warriors right now. I want to share yep. that with you guys. And I am I trying. Love that game. I love that game. I am going to try the new Tomb Raider. This is actually the first Tomb Raider game I will ever play, so I'm excited about that. Uh, I'll be bringing that to you guys probably soon. Uh, and I actually might might do some streaming tonight if you guys listen tonight of uh, some Call of Duty uh, Advanced Warfare Zombies. I made it to round 30 last night with my buddy, and we had a, f a pretty fun time. So uh, just show us some love, guys. Please start leaving comments. If you don't like our videos, please tell us why. Uh, 
and we'll we'll work around you guys. Well, I'm willing to right. change for the community. So um, just give us a chance, and we love right. you guys. Uh, right. Thanks, uh, thanks again for thanks, watching. Thanks again for um, watching. Um, see us again, same, us again, same, same place, same, same place, time, same time, next, time week, next week, hopefully. Um, uh, yeah. Other than that, other and let us know. That. Let us know if you guys like this new thing. We're trying video uh, with this right. podcast instead of just audio. Uh, we're showing you guys our beautiful faces. Uh, wow. wow. Uh, so wow. <laughs> let us know in the comments section if you guys like this. And let us know if you guys have any uh, maybe other topics you want us to cover in future podcasts. It could be anything uh, uh, entertainment-wise. We could cover maybe some movies coming out too. Like, hey, we'd like to see these movies or uh, whatever, something else gaming-related. So uh, even sports, I, we dabble in some NFL football. Go so, Bucks represent. Go Bucks represent. Uh, Go Bills Mafia, baby. Buffalo Bills. Here Sunny we go. Tampa, Florida, baby. Let's, Florida, go. baby. Let's go. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, guys, let us know. We love you guys. Uh, and until next Peace time. Peace out. This, Peace has, been out. Triforce. this has been Triforce. Triforce. Batman out. Join the Force.